Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. So today I'm going to show you how to edit multiple camera angle in Filmora 11. Okay, so this is a question from one of my subscribers. He want to, to sh uh, he want to ask about how to edit a video with multiple camera. For example, I have a Canon 800 D here uh, with my main camera, and now I have another phone here uh, with my Samsung A70 with my second camera angle. Okay, so we're going to edit this video in Filmora 11 just to show you the tips and trick on how to edit multiple camera angle with Filmora. Okay, because we don't have special multiple camera angle feature in Filmora 11 yet. Maybe we can have in the future. But, uh, okay, so first thing first, if you want to shoot video with multiple camera, you have to to make sure that you have the audio on both camera, on this one, uh, on the phone, and also on the DSLR, okay? If you don't have the same camera, then you can have the same camera setting uh, or the same picture profile, stuff like that, to have the same quality. And the ideal solution is that you have multiple cameras with the same brand, for example, Canon and Sony, or stuff like that. Otherwise, the video quality would be different. Okay, and also make sure that you select the same picture profile also. If you shoot in log or S log or C log or stuff like that, you want to shoot in C log or S log for all your camera, okay? Not like this. This phone video quality is very bad. And this one, better. All right, so let's go to my computer screen. All right, so now I'm on my computer screen and I already copied the clip to my computer. So this is a clip from my DSLR and this is from my phone. So we need to import them to Filmora to start editing video, okay? So I'm going to open my Filmora 11 and then I'm going to create a new project. For this example, I'm going to select 16 by 9, which is a YouTube video. And then I'm going to click new project. All right, and now I need to import them to the media. Okay, just drag and drop them here. Also just see here okay and I have video here ready in the media folder I would cancel the proxy because I don't want to wait for the proxy creation okay so first thing we need to synchronize the video of the main camera and the second camera okay to do that we just need to put the main video here at the first video track on the timeline and let's keep the project setting okay so I'm going to change the project setting to 24 frames per second because I shoot in 24 frames, okay. And then we need to overlay the second camera video on the top track right here and also keep the project setting. Okay, and now you can see the audio waveform of the first one, uh, let's straight out the timeline. The first one and the second one, they are not synchronized. Okay, so we need to synchronize them. And to do that, all we need to do is to separate the audio of the, the, the second camera. Because I'm not going to use the, the audio here in this video because I use my phone so the audio is very bad. But uh, this camera, I use a Rode Wireless Go so the, the audio of this video is good. And I'm going to use it, okay? So we are going to detach the audio of this one. And now we need to select this video and this audio track. And now we can just right click and select auto synchronization okay and it will synchronize the audio and the video and wait a few seconds so Filmora did a good job in this synchronization all right so we will keep the playhead at the same position so just keep it right here and then we need to move the video the second video to this playhead okay just move it to here yeah snap with the playhead right here and now it's okay and we can just mute the audio from here and play the video and listen to it hi guys welcome to another tutorial on my channel so, so it's very good right so now we can delete the audio here on this track for example i can just delete it and now we can just split the beginning of the clip right here we need to select both clip here and then split and now we want to rip or delete here at the beginning because I don't want to keep the beginning. Okay, so just rip or delete the things here. And now is the trick, the main trick for this tutorial. 
So now, if you want to edit multiple camera here, you want to have this second camera on the top layer of the, the main video. And if you have three camera, for example, you want to have another one right here. And then you can just click this button to hide this track, okay, to show the main camera angle. And now you can play and see uh, which part you want to split and delete or stuff like that. Or whenever you want to show the, the second camera, all you need to do is to just split that section and move up one track. Let me do it for you, okay? Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. So today I'm going to show you how to edit multiple camera angle in Filmora 11. Okay, so this is a question from one of my subscribers. He want to, to uh, he want to ask about how to edit. Okay, for example, at this position, I want to delete this part because I just mummy or something like that. So I want to play it again. Okay, so because he won, so I'm going to split here. So I'm going to select both uh, both video here. Okay, just split and then select this side. Move my playhead to this position and then split here. And now we need to repo delete this part. Right click and select repo delete and to make it a better video. Okay. Want to, he want to ask about how to edit a video with multiple camera. For example, I have a Canon 800D here uh, with my main camera. And, and now I, I point to my second camera. So this is the point that we want to split. The first, the first one. We want to split it right here. And now let's play it until I go back to my main camera. Okay. And now I have another phone here uh, with my. Okay. So at this position, I go back to my main camera. So I. I will split the video right here and now I want to show the second camera. All I need to do is to move up one, tra one track, something like this, and then we have two camera angle. Let's play it. With my main camera and now I have another phone here uh, with my Samsung A70. Okay, so I, I look at my second camera again so we can just do the same with my second camera angle. And here at this position, I go back to my main camera. So I I am going to split it right here and then just move up one track. With my second camera angle. Okay, so we're going to edit this video in Filmora 11 just to show you the... Okay, so that's all the tip. If you want to edit multiple camera angle with Filmora 11. And you can do the same for the rest of the video. And whenever you want to split the part or delete something, you want to select all of them. And then you can just rip or delete. By doing that, you can keep this video synchronized with each other. And added to that, if you want to have the same look of all the video, there's one tip here. You want to add a lot to both of them. Okay, just go to the effect tab. And then you want to find the LUT folder here. And now select a lot for your video. If you shoot it C log or S log, it is better. For example, I can select the movie lot and put it right here. Okay, and then I can adjust the lot. Just reduce the opacity because it look not very good for me. And then I'm going to extend it the lot to the duration of the video and let's play it. And camera. And now I have another phone here. But to be honest, I'm not satisfied with the video quality of the phone and also the, my main camera. By the way, it is how to edit multiple camera angle in Filmora 11. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you have any more questions, just let me know in the comment section below. And if you are new here, consider to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.